To program a Trilogy Lock using the Data Transfer Module, the first thing that you must do is you must make sure that your uh, PCI cable is uh, set up correctly. To do this, you click on Tools and you go to COM Port Setup and Test. And here you will uh, check uh, the radio button Test All and then you're going to click Test. Now one of these COM ports will come back with no loopback data found and the other one will say loopback test passed. The one that says loopback test passed is the one, the radio button you will check for the COM port and then click set. Now you're ready to go program uh, your DTM so you can program your locks. To do this you go under the DTM uh, icon that you hear at the top and this will open up your DTM support screen. You will pick the lock that you are going to program, which will be the DL2800. You must pick a function by clicking three times to drop down the menu. I'm going to pick Send Program. And then you must have a lock, that lock selected. Uh, now you will uh, make sure that your DTM is uh, plugged in and it is on uh, PC COM mode. Now I just click Program DTM and now it will send all of that data to the DTM so I can program the lock. Now when you get out to a new lock that has never been programmed, the first thing that you need to do is change the master code to match what you have in the software and to add the DTM download code. So to do this, you put the lock into program mode by putting in the 123456 master code and then hitting AL. And then you're going to change the master code, AL1, AL, new master code, AL, new master code again, and then star. While we're still in program mode, we're going to add that DTM download code. And that is adding a user, which is AL2, AL user slot 299 AL and then your DTM download code and then star. Now you can come out of program mode by holding down any key on the keypad. Let the lock reset. Now on your DTM you're going to go to uh, uh, D, uh, door select mode which you're going to push the button under no until you get to door select mode and then push yes you're going to set the door to whatever the number is and click set and now you're going to plug in your cable into the lock you're going to push the button under go and then you're going to enter your DTM download code and now the lock will be programming and then when it is complete you'll see that it's running through when it's complete the DTM will beep and the lock will beep and then you'll be able to use the lock. Comms complete. I want to thank you for uh, watching this video. Um, I hope it was informative and um, you were able to learn something about how to program the uh, Trilogy locks. If you'd like to learn more about Alarm Lock, you can go to alarmlock.com and click on the Resources tab and there's a link there so you can download programming manuals. You can watch uh, recorded webinars. You can attend a live webinar. Uh, you can also sign up for my uh, training blog, my technical blog. Uh, if you sign up for it, then anytime I make a post, it will go directly to your inbox. And we'll make uh, posts about new, vi new videos, new software, uh, new products, uh, basically anything alarm lock. If there's something that you would like to learn how to do, uh, a topic on the uh, Trilogy Locks or the software, you can send me a... Uh, an email at aphelps at alarmlock.com that's a-p-h-e-l-p-s at alarmlock.com and I'll do my best to get that video uh, out and post it on this site. 